So a homie hit me up on Instagram asking me if I wanted to try out some of his uh, boards and stuff. Naturally, I said yes because who doesn't want free boards? Just a couple hours ago, this came in the mail. Uh, he sent me three decks. Um, he sent me a photo, but I forgot what he sent. So this is gonna be like a complete like surprise because I totally forgot what he sent me. I know it's not gonna be graphic. This is gonna be an unboxing, packaging, parceling. I'm just gonna say it's an opening. Because we're going to be opening a parcel. Yo, LBC, come on, man. This is the parcel. This is the package. This is like freaking like 10% of the package. No, 10% of the parcel. Come on, LBC. Do you have like something smaller than this? I do have a knife. I remember this because this knife is actually kind of worthless because... This thing scares you. It's not really that sharp. Yeah, this thing sucks. So, yeah, there it is, and that's the bag. Oh, I need another plate. So this is the package. It's like a bomb. And open it. Bag. And he sent me some foam tape, and he said it, this is nice foam tape. So I'm gonna be definitely using this because. I do ride for nice foam tape, so if I got sponsored, I'm gonna use as much product that the company sponsoring me uh, sent. So, we got three pieces of nice foam tape. It's gonna be in the pile. I see a note. Oh! 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 I love these! Jesus! Sick! Thanks! He sent me a cat sticker, which, dude, I love cats. And he sent me a potted plant. Oh, this is kind of. Special. And he sent me a note. So it says, Hello Gab, thank you for- It's just weird. It's weird that people refer to me as Gab. So, yeah, I'll let it slide. Thank you for giving us the opportunity, sending, and letting you try out the decks I made. Dude, my alliteration is actually way off the charts, man. Thank you for giving us the opportunity, sending, and letting you try out the decks I made. I hope you will like the shape. I plan on starting a deck company called Redex. I wish you have a joyful life, Sheldon. P.S. Can you give me a feedback regarding the shape? Thank you. Yes, uh, Sheldon, I am going to be giving you feedback. I'm going to be doing an honest review about this. So, so now let's start on with the decks, and I need the freaking... Why do I keep, like... Uh, okay. This is why I need a an unboxing knife because an unboxing knife is gonna be way more smoother and way more effortless. Like one of those EDC knives. See, I can smell it. And oh, oh, a stick. Ooh, yo, it's actually really sticky. Yep. So this is the deck. He sent me only one. A 15 ply deck. Nah, just kidding. It's actually really stuck together. That's one. It's a two-tone. Two. Ooh! I didn't know that he's gonna do this. First, first, okay, first. Clean up. Dude, this is insane. Yo, this is insane. So this first deck that I saw. This is a. I don't know what you call this, like ply or something. I don't know what kind of ply this is. I'm not a wood guy. I used to be a wood guy, but I don't know what kind of guy am I. <laughs> Does that make sense? He uh, marked it 33 and Redex on the bottom. This is actually insane. For a new board company, the craftsmanship on this is actually amazing. A uh, pencil tail, which is actually, I haven't had one of those. And I don't know if the nose and tail are the same length. But the shape is actually really different. This is insane. I mean, there's like a couple nicks on the like lacquer and stuff because they're like sticking together. Second deck, this I did not know. This, ooh, what the? Is this hand painted? So the second board is actually just a maple ply with hand painted, I think. Which actually, it's a camera with like my favorite colors on them, which is. 
actually really, really cool. I didn't know he was gonna do that. And the top fly, the top fly is actually really cool, but it has like a matte feel to it. A same shape as the last one, it's like a pencil cut, but like I think the tail is longer. And then the last one, he sent me the third board, it's a two-tone. I never had a two-tone before, this is cool. And right here as well, same thing, 33 redex. I'm blown away by this man. These three decks, these are actually amazing. Some of the countersinks are not clean, and some of the drill holes aren't clean as well, so I'm gonna give the craftsmanship from the first look. I'm gonna give the craftsmanship on this. It's an eight. Eight, eight and a half, nine, around there. You need to work on your uh, side shaping skills because this is the same issue that I said to Iloaf as well, that he doesn't have rounded off edges. It's like a, he has a boxy edge. So yeah, but overall, these are actually quality decks. To recap, he got me this, I'm gonna call this like the uh, Wormwood, a art deck, which I do see this a lot from Third Eye, and a Two-Tone. So I'm gonna be setting up one of these so I could test them. I think I'm gonna use this brown one because this is actually really, really nice, the Wormwood. Trademark, one wood. That's it. He sent me like three decks, three foam tapes, and really, really cool stickers. I like these. And a note. So stay tuned for the uh, other videos that I'm going to be uh, posting because I'm going to do an honest review and a setup video for this. So yeah, before, the, before I close this off, uh, I'm going like to give a big thank you to Sheldon because he is very generous enough to send me these decks and uh, really, really cool. Uh, I've been talking with him for like a couple of days, he's actually a good guy. Um, follow him at underscore Elsa. I don't know how to say it because it's like at underscore L-X-U-H, so Elsa. So yeah, I hope you guys enjoyed this video. Um, stay tuned for the other videos I'm going to be making for this and follow me on Instagram so you can see the high resolution photos of this. And Follow my TikTok. I'm gonna, yeah, I'm, I do TikTok. So, yeah. <laughs> Hope you all have an amazing day, and I'll see you in the next one. Peace out, board out, and the usual lens cap out. It's pretty far, so I gotta nudge out. Bye. Yeah, you can tell that I'm old.